The 716 in two minutes, brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers. I'm 7 First Alert meteorologist Autumn Lewandowski. Our forecast for the day today is going to be in the middle 50s. We're going to find some showers early on through the day, some clearing into the afternoon. For tonight, we'll watch temperatures drop into the middle 40s. How does all of this happen? We're going to find these rain showers through midday. We'll find clearing from Friday afternoon into the evening and then sunshine to start Saturday. The clouds don't thicken up until later in the afternoon and those spotty showers end up coming in around 11 o'clock. Tomorrow's forecast is right near the 60 degree mark. Autumn, thanks. Good morning to you. I'm Ed Ranch. One day after declaring Erie County was heading in the wrong direction, County Executive Mark Polencar says there's been a slight decrease in overall patients for COVID-19. The data shows hospitalizations in Erie County is at an extended plateau. Experts say we aren't following a severe curve. Rather, we're staying relatively flat. Those models are critical, though, in the decision about the rest of the school year that could come as soon as today. The school year already nearing the end, but classes could be back before then. Governor Cuomo said he would make a decision by the end of this week. Schools have been closed for more than a month now and will be closed until at least May 15th when the state's PAUSE Act expires. The Buffalo Park System is offering some job opportunities to those who need one. The Olmsted Parks Conservancy is looking for dozens of full and part-time workers for the summer and the fall. You can find links to apply right now on WKBW.com. And that's the 716 for you in two minutes. Thanks for being with us on this Friday. The next update is available for you later today and always on WKBW.com. Have a great weekend. The 716 in two minutes brought to you by Custom Carpet Centers.